Hey y'all, it's Brady. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me. If you are brand new here, hi, hello, welcome. We are a family of four. It is myself, my husband, and our six and three-year-old girls. And in today's video, I am going to share with you a grocery haul. I am headed to do a Target pickup order because they have a, a Target Circle coupon for red card holders, which is just a debit card. It is not a credit card. It, you can, but mine is just a debit card. Um, so I'm already getting the 5% off everything. Plus I had a bunch of Target Circle coupons, which do work with drive up. And then also with drive up or in store or even shipped delivery, if you use their website, you can save $10 off your hundred dollar purchase of anything in the store. So, um, I think it excludes gift cards, but other than, and maybe alcohol, but other than that, it counts. So I am in an effort to save myself some time i'm gonna do a drive up order from target and then we're gonna run into kroger we have to also run into Publix and pick up some medicine and some deli meat and like one couponing or two couponing items so i'm gonna run in and do those two things at those two stores and i gotta get gas and then i think i'm gonna treat ourselves to breakfast this morning from hardy's on the way home it is now 8 10 so it's gonna be a late breakfast hopefully i can get through these other stores quickly because i really don't want to be out very long it is cold, it is foggy. I don't know if you can see like that fog there behind me. It's pretty intense. So anyways, I got up, got myself somewhat ready. I'm still kind of bumming out, but you know, whatever. And I'm gonna head to the store when we get home or when I get home, cause it's just me. Um, when I get home, I will show you everything that we got. So let's go. I am back from the store and I thought I'd show you everything that I got. I spent right at, I think, $163. Well, it was $183, but 20 of that is not part of the grocery budget. It's some household type stuff we needed. I'll show you that. And I do still need to run to Aldi for a couple of things for a taste test video that we want to try because uh, we are rounding up our things for the taste test video. And then we'll be doing that in the next week or two and then getting that posted for y'all. I've got a lot of videos actually that I need to get edited and posted for y'all. I've got a holiday baking video and a prep for Christmas video and all the cooking I did that I'd never got that posted. And then I also have an update video that I filmed last night. Um, my thoughts on 2020, my goals for 2021 and life update, all that good stuff that I need to get up. Plus this, plus more to come. So I really need to get to editing, <laughs> but let's go ahead and I'll show you everything that I got. All of this is from Target, Drive Up, Kroger, and then a few things I got at Publix when I had to go get medicine that were on sale there. So I'll show you there. If you do not already have Ibotta, you want Ibotta because I did get something. I got these fruit cups for like 12 cents a package thanks to Ibotta and one little printable coupon. So um, if you're brand new to Ibotta, you're, I think you're going to get $10.00 when you sign up and then I think I get like a dollar or two or something as a referral. So I'm gonna leave that linked down below if you're brand new to it. Um, if you're like, I do not wanna get out of my house, I wanna order groceries. I do have a 10 off 50 of your first purchase from Walmart pickup or delivery. And I have a coupon code for $50 off your $99 annual membership for shipped if you just wanna order from Target that way and have it delivered. So lots of options. And I'm just going to turn it around, show you what I got. Okay, so here's a look at everything that I picked up. A lot, a lot of stuff I feel like today um, for our budget, but uh, that's a good thing. So I got some things that I haven't been purchasing, just, you know, trying to save money and save up for our stock up haul. If you've not seen my last grocery haul, we did a massive Sam's Club haul. So I'm going to hop, I'm going to pop that, not hop it. I'm going to pop that link up above for you and at the end of the video too. It was over $900. We got a lot of household and a lot of food. 
The freezers are jam packed. So I think there's only one freezer thing. Everything else is fresh stuff. Um, to note, we still have some mandarin oranges, some apples, a couple of stray bananas that are gonna need to be made into banana bread in the next couple of days. We have some zucchini left. We have baby carrots. We have cucumbers. We have frozen veggies, rice, cauliflower. We still have that head of cabbage that I've yet to make. <laughs> um, so there's lots of fruits and veggies here. If you do not know, um, I tend to buy my meat in bulk from Sam's Club a couple of times a year. On occasion, I'll buy it, especially if it's on a good sale when I go to the weekly hauls. But I do not buy weekly just what we need that week. I buy like best deals, that sort of thing plus fresh stuff for the week. So here's our fresh stuff. We got a bag of cuties. This was from Target and Target I mentioned had 10 off $100 if you have a Target red card. So um, that's a heck of a deal. Um, and so I went on ahead plus I had 10% off of these. So I think it made the cuties $3.99 plus 10 off of the whole order. The 12 packs of Pepsi um, and Coke products were Three for 11, so I got one 12 pack of Cherry 7-Up, one ch Wild Cherry Pepsi, and one regular Pepsi. We still have lots of Pepsis left from Sam's Club, but um, that's kind of like my mom's sanity thing. I don't drink the sweet tea anymore, and I don't drink um, anything else other than water, so on occasion I might have a glass of apple juice. But anyways, that, that was a good deal, so I went on ahead and got them. So we'll have some stocked and I don't have to pay full price in the future. Kroger, 50 cents for green onions, 79 cents for cilantro. The boar's head, which one is this? The boar's head maple honey turkey was $8.99 a pound. Look at that, they got that right at a pound. So I got a pound of that for sandwiches this weekend. And then I looked at just getting like the pre-packaged uh, roast beef. This was $12.89 a pound, the boar's head um, top round roast beef. However, when I priced that out, they were $5 per seven ounce package for like the Kroger brand or whatever. Um, like just the pre-packaged roast beef lunch meat. And so I thought, no, for the same price per ounce practically, because even if I'd gotten two of those, that's only 14 ounces, this is a pound, you know. So anyways, um, I just thought, no, I'm going to get the thin shaved one that I like. So that's what I got. We're going to use those King's wine rolls, some Swiss cheese, some butter, poppy seeds, garlic powder, and make some like funeral sandwiches or whatever you want to call them, hot sandwiches, um, one night this week. And then I got this garden salad blend for 99 cents at uh, Target. 99 cents for some shredded iceberg lettuce. We're doing tacos again this week. Hearts of Romaine, this was unavailable from Target, so I did it. Uh, I got picked it up while I was in Publix. This was $2.69 for their Hearts of Romaine. Uh, $2.59 for some watermelon. Publix is like the only place that if watermelon's going to be any good this time of year, it's going to be from there. So I just got a small bit of it because I was craving some. $2.49 from Target for these brioche hamburger buns. That's cheaper than our Aldi. So I try to get those each time I go. $1.89 for an 18 count of eggs at um, Target, excuse me, Target. And then $2.69 for the Kroger whole milk. We still have a gallon left from Sam's Club. So I just got the one gallon. The Lunchables were, they're $1.99 each at Target, but when you buy three, you get three free. So it makes them, you know, 99 cents, 98 cents, whatever a piece. Um, so that's the same as, you know, like the 10 for 10 type thing. So I got five of the bologna and American and one of the nachos, chips, and cheese. $1.25 for the Kroger brand white bread. $1.79 for this French baguette from the Publix Bakery. Three lemons, they were 49 cents each from Target. Three green bell peppers, because believe it or not, between freezer meals, and that's another video I've got coming for y'all is I did a bunch of freezer prep. So between that and then using on this past week, we are out of the 12 peppers that I cut up. Um, I do have a few still cut up for a recipe I'm gonna make, but uh, yeah, that was it. So I needed three more bell peppers. We go through those like crazy in this house. They were 60, no, 79 cents each from Target. These were 19 cents each at Target. So I got two. We're not gonna use the flavor packet. We're just gonna use the noodles. 
I wanted to make like a copycat lo mein noodles. They did not have any lo mein noodles or anything even similar at any of the stores when I looked on the apps. So I just got it from Target. We'll use these and hopefully that'll be okay. $2.39 each for the salsa con queso Kroger brand cheese dip. I got one for taco bake and one just to stash in the pantry for whoever wants to snack on that. These were $3, which this is a tiny bag, so it's kind of outrageous. I needed this for a um, taste test video that I've been mentioning. So we've been on the hunt for these white chocolate cheesecake M&Ms to try for that. So I got those at Target. This I had to get from Kroger. It's the Kit Kat Duos, Mocha and Chocolate. We're also going to try that one. 99 cents for the fried rice seasoning packet. I just always pick up one of those at Target. $1.25, no, $1.50 for the Kroger brand mac and cheese. We still have mac and cheese back in the pantry, but I wanted to have one more stashed back in there. $1.69 for a head, no, yeah, $1.69 for a head of iceberg lettuce. That is for lettuce wraps, and that was from Target. These Kaleidos salted caramel and chocolate I've never seen before. This is going to be for our taste test video. The Ritz chips, the toasted chips, and all their other type stuff like this are buy one, get one free. So they're $3.89 for two at my Publix. Plus, I had a $0.75 cent off to coupon. So I don't know what that made them. It made them like $1.34 or something like that, a bag. And those are phenomenal. Uh, two of these Del Monte. So it was a limit of one um, or else I would have gotten way more of these. But they're two, they're on sale for $2 a package for these four count um, fruit cups. And then there's a buy one, get one free Publix coupon. So that takes them down to a dollar a package, which if I could have used more of those coupons, I totally would have gotten as many as I could, but it was one per household per day. So I just did the one. So it's a dollar per package. Then I had a either dollar, I think it was a dollar off to printable coupon. And if I can, I'll try to link it down below. Um, fingers crossed that I remember to do that. But anyways, um, it was just from the Del Monte website. And so then that made them 50 cents each. And then there's a 75 cent off to Ibotta rebate off any two Del Monte fruit cups. So I paid 25 cents for two of these. Heck of a deal. So um, and I think if you get the bubble fruit ones, then it's an even better deal if that's even possible. So I got one of the cherry mixed fruit 100% juice and one of the mango pineapple 100% juice. So we still have obviously the fruit cups from Sam's Club, but I can could not pass up that deal. Like I said, even at a dollar per package without the coup the other coupon, without the printable coupon and I bought a a dollar per package is a heck of a deal. It's even cheaper than Aldi or Walmart. However, it was a limit one. So maybe if I head back over there and I'm in the store again, I'll grab another set of two. These tummy yummies for the girls, just a little treat for them. They were 59 cents each at Kroger, got four of those. Hoisin sauce, I needed some more. This is the Kroger brand, it was $2.49. I had a free digital coupon on my uh, Publix coupon account thing where you put your phone number in. And this is one I was wanting to try anyways for our taste test video. This is the Mountain Dew Major Melon. So that was just a 20 ounce to try and it was totally free. So we got that. This was $1.59 for the rainbow chip frosting from Target. $1.79 for the whipped cream cheese spread. I think this is eight ounces. Yep. From Kroger. $1.39 for the Kroger natural sour cream. 16 ounce. That's our favorite. Uh, this is our favorite French onion dip. It's $1.99 for the 32 ounce at Kroger. So I got that. Two refried beans. We're going to have one this week for tacos. One to put in the pantry. Those were 79 cents each. These toaster scrambler scrambles are on sale by one get one free at Publix. At my Publix, they are $1.95, so it made them less than a dollar per box. Um, time the bo the BOGO price. So I got four if I'd have had more room in my freezer, but I don't. We're gonna be struggling to stash these away. But anyways, these are an easy breakfast for my husband or for the kids, whoever wants them. I got three bacon and one sausage. And 
Then I have this, we're gonna try this, the Market Pantry 100% Colombian 12 count K-Cups. If you are new here, then you don't know, but if you're not new here, then you do know. Um, and now you know, if you don't know, now you know, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna stop. Um, <laughs> this is 419. My husband's favorite is the Kroger brand, 100% Colombian. We're gonna try this. This was cheaper because they're not on sale right now at Kroger. But anyways, 419 plus 20% off Target Circle coupon. I don't remember what that made it, but it was a good deal. $1.79 for one Kroger brand pie crust. These are better than Pillsbury, in my opinion. So I picked up those. $1.89 for the Simply Diced Potatoes. These are like the refrigerated ones. We're gonna make a big breakfast this weekend. And then 99 cents for a pound of pinto dry beans. So I got those, a dollar not from Target, a dollar 99 also from Target, the Louisiana's iced tea bags, 24 count family size bags. That's for my husband's unsweet tea. All of the Kroger brand eight ounce cheeses, either the blocks or the shredded was a dollar 25 as long as you bought four or more. So I got five, I got two Monterey Jack blocks cause I like to shred that one. Two, the pre-shredded Parmesan, and one pre-shredded sharp cheddar. 99 cents for this Kroger brand roasted red pepper vinaigrette. This is for marinating chicken. This is 99 cents. You can get up to five at that price with a 50 cent digital coupon on your Kroger card. $1.99 for the Market Pantry 30 ounce mayonnaise. We've talked about this before, but it's one of our favorites. And it was also 10 or 15% off with a Target Circle coupon. So we're not out, but I went on ahead and picked one up to stash in the pantry. $1.59 for the Old El Paso cheesy Mexican rice for the pantry as well. $2.79 or $2.69 now, I can't remember. For the Cheez-Its, we're going to make Crispix mix again. So we got those, $3.50 for the family size box or maybe $3.99. One five pound bag of the King Arthur bread flour. We're going to see if that makes a difference in baking bread. And it was $3.59. And then I got one for $1.59 or $1.25, something like that at Target. The uh, rainbow chip cake mix. $3 for the baked Lay's there. $2.50 plus 20% off for the Doritos regular size bag of chips because believe it or not this family of mine i had two whole dorito chips but that bag from sam's last week is gone i knew it would be i knew they'd be the first to go so um that's for a dorito chicken casserole thing i'm gonna make 289 for the sharing size peanut butter m ms and then this crate was four dollars we are doing distance learning and i needed something to corral all of her school stuff then for my haul closet video, yet another video I am working on for y'all, um, redesigning and reorganizing things in the house. So I needed more of these. These like shoebox style with the lids are 80, no, 99 cents. I got eight of those. I got two more of these glass pitchers that I bought back before Christmas and they were $5 each. So one is going to be a backup for my husband's unsweet tea. These are half gallons. And then one, I'm going to start putting the purified water and the lemons and limes sliced up in there for myself and to keep that cold. I had that at a baby shower and I was like, ooh, that is delicious. $3.39 for the Up and Up brand of the Splendid. I was going to say Vivid White. I think that's the Crest brand. Um, 32 ounce alcohol-free whitening mouth rinse for my husband. I want to try these. These uh, hydro colloid, whatever. There you go. Uh, gel bandages. Supposedly, this is good for acne, and this was only $3.39. So, we're going to try it um, instead of like the ones made for acne. We're going to give it a try. I've watched way too much Instagram TikTok videos. <laughs> um, what else? This was $2.99 for the Super Floss. These pre-cut strands for bridges, braces, and wide spaces um, for my husband. $3.39, I needed another one of these command bathroom hooks. And you couldn't just get a one-pack, so I got a two-pack. We'll have an extra. And $3.19 for a combination lock for my husband for work. $1.49 for some straws. Yes, I use reusable straws, but hey, it's getting my water in, and so we're going to go with that. 
$2.99 for the um, plastic shower curtain liner. These are normally where I get them at uh, Dollar Tree. And they're definitely cheaper, but I was not going more places. So, pick that up from Target. Also, this spray was $2.99 at Target. $5.99 for the Kroger Children's Allergy Relief, 8 ounce. Um, that's for me. That's a whole separate issue, but I do take that pretty regularly, unfortunately. And SOS pads, again, would be a Dollar Tree purchase, but this was $3.99, I think. And for 18 count steel wool SOS pads. I needed those for our stainless steel pans. Goodness gracious, that's a lot of stuff today. That's all I've got. I'm going to put this cold stuff away, and then we got to get my kiddo back on distance learning so she needs the table that is everything all right. Let me flip all so right. that's everything sorry it's loud in here boxes from sam's and different deliveries so we got to get that stuff taken out today we got to get this cold stuff put up thank y'all so much for joining me let me know where you are doing your grocery shopping what's on your meal plan and i will see y'all in the comments down below until the next video bye bye